Lauren B said, Sarah, I read and loved your book, but I couldn't believe all the stuff about the sing-off. What was the worst part of the experience? This is really interesting. You wrote really, uh, you, said, you said being a part of that show actually made you go back to therapy. Yeah. Uh, and so was there one thing that was the nadir of the experience? You know, what I found that I, and this isn't to lay blame on anyone, it was, it was an experience where I, I found myself saying a lot of yeses to things that I wasn't comfortable doing. Mm -hmm. I, I think that there was an idea of what their dream aesthetic of the show was going to look and feel like in terms of my contribution to that, and I and I didn't feel like I was looking and feeling like myself, and yeah. I ended up just really grappling with. I, I mean, I grew up as a fat kid, and I have a lot of I have a lot of deep seated interest. I mean, issues, it, and it doesn't ever go away, you know. So you always yeah. sort of see yourself that Live way. Live in that or that image of yourself. In that. Right. Yeah. So the I, healing of it wasn't. It, it right. happened after. So I'm actually really grateful to the show, and and yeah, I don't want to lay blame, but it was a, it was painful for me. Yeah. I guess the moral of the story is stay true to yourself. You know, know what you're comfortable doing. Yeah, and, just yeah. like remembering to say, say no. Just yeah. say no. <laughs> just say no uh, to being on the well, sing-off. it's what we <laughs> talk about. Thanks for watching. Watch more clips here and subscribe to our channel here. See ya.